Today, let us learn about the fundamental operations of numbers. You have already learned addition in your previous class. Now, you will learn to solve problems in daily life situations which involves additions. Let us take an example. In a town, there are 38,649 men, 37,986 women and 13,784 children. What is the total population of the town? Let us write down what is given in the problem. We know the following details. Number of men in town is equal to 38,649. Number of women in town are 37,986. Number of children in town are 13,784. So, we have written what is given in the problem in the manner shown. We need to find the total population of the town. What is the total population? The total population of the town is the sum of all these three numbers which is 38,649 plus 37,986 plus 13,000 784 which is equal to 90,419. Therefore, the total population of the town is equal to 90,419 which is the sum of the total number of men, women and children in the town. Let us look at another example. In order to construct a house, a contractor spends 35,000 on bricks, 15,000 on stones, rupees 57,600 on cement and 38,200 rupees on iron and a total of 1,8,900 rupees on wages and other miscellaneous items. What is the amount spent on constructing the house? As seen in the previous example, let us write down what is given in the problem. We know the following details. The amount spent on bricks is equal to 35,000. Amount spent on stones is equal to 15,000. Amount spent on cement is equal to 57,600. Amount spent on iron is equal to 38,200. Amount spent on wages and other expenses is 1,8,900. So, the amount spent on constructing the house is the sum total or the addition of all these numbers which is 35,000 plus 15,000 plus 57,600 plus 38,200 plus 1,8,900 rupees. The total of all these is equal to 2 lakhs 54,700 rupees. So we can say that the total amount spent on constructing the house is equal to 2 lakhs 54,700 rupees.